It's Roy Kelly for seconds out with joined by Pat McCormack, Olympic silver medalist, world championship silver medalist and about to embark on a new journey, Pat. How does it feel? Yeah, it's unbelievable. Obviously, it's been a long time coming. I've been to two Olympics, three Europeans, three world championships. Done what I could as, a, as an amateur. I won gold everywhere. If it wasn't gold, it was silver. So I had nothing more to do. And now it's time for the pit, the pro ranks. There was no uh, debate about maybe trying for Paris in three years? No, nah, to be honest, uh, I, was, uh, I was thinking on whether I stay in to, uh, Tokyo. And then it getting knocked back a year, just started to sicken us a little bit. The amateurs, just that extra year, just killed us. But I'm looking forward to going pro. It's been a long time coming, so we're here now. You've not exactly rushed either, Pat. Obviously, you won your medal uh, last August. You've taken your time. Was that deliberate to get the right trainer, the right management set up? Yeah, definitely. Just had to look about, seeing what's best for me. Um, I had a, had a bit time off as well, obviously, leaving the GB squad. Um, I've been on there for nine years, so when I left there, it was like I had to live normal for a bit and uh, I was enjoying myself for a bit. But then I got to Christmas and I thought well, I need to start meeting some moves. Obviously, I got teamed up with Ben Davison, signed with Probellum, and uh, now here. How difficult, or, or maybe how easy has the transition been from Sheffield five days a week to working with Ben? It's been easy, to be honest. Um, it's just different style of training. Um, obviously, the longer rounds, little gloves on. It's just a whole different style of boxing. How what the things he's got us doing. It's like he's got he's he's opened me, me eyes up about boxing. I thought I knew everything about boxing, but there's a total new total new side of the, the pro game. With Ben, um, obviously he's a new trainer. He's a bright trainer. Is is that what attracted you to him? Uh, yeah, definitely. And just just um, watching videos of him on the pads in their fights, watching his advice in the corner. Obviously the people he's worked with. So if he's good enough for like Josh Taylor, Tyson Fury, Billy Joe Saunders, he's good enough for me. They're happy with him, I'm happy with him. How's the relationship been so far in the, the time you've worked with him? Yeah, it's been good. Eh? I liked Ben before I knew him. Obviously, you'd seen him on interviews and that, I thought he's sound, you know what I mean? I'll get on well with him and eh, yeah, we'll get on well. We'll have good crack in the gym and eh, we're ready to push on for eh, titles. Yeah, you were at the very elite level as an amateur. How quickly do you think it'll take you to get up there as a professional? Um, I'm not sure really. I've got six fights this year. Uh, I'm just going to have them, see where I'm at at the end of the year, and then we'll um, make a plan from what we're going to do from there. Yeah. I'm just getting my feet wet though in these pro games. It's me, obviously my debut. I've done a six WSB, so I've got a little bit of experience with the little gloves on and that and the longer rounds, but I'm just enjoying the, uh, the road to the top. Yeah. What's it like to be the special attraction and in your native North East as well this weekend? Yeah, definitely. Um, it's unbelievable. Obviously, I haven't boxed here for about six or seven years, so it's good for me, family and friends, be able to come here and watch us in the flesh instead of waking up at Daft Climbs, watching us on the on the phone or whatever they've been watching us on, and actually come and watch us and support us and shout and that. And, and six rounds as well for your debut rather than four. Yeah. Uh, was, was that was that your idea that to get straight in um, and in the longer rounds? No point in doing four rounds. Uh, I've already boxed five rounds as an amateur in WSB, so. It's just right to do the, uh, the six rounds, do a couple of six rounds, eight, and just keep getting up until we get to the 12s. Yeah. You're boxing Danny Mendoza on Friday night, a uh, Spanish-based Nicaraguan. What do you know about Danny? Um, I know he's halfy half, um, tough, durable man. Um, he's been in with a, in a couple of other prospects and they couldn't get him out there. But uh, I'm just looking to go in there and put on a show. What can we expect from Pat McCormack on Friday night? Fireworks, boxing, what can we expect? Yeah, very skillful boxing, um, very smart. And uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to be a new fighter than what I've been in the amateurs. My style's totally changed, so you're going to have to pay to come watch it. Many thanks, Pat, and all the best for Friday night. Cheers, mate. Thank you.